There is something I completely forgot to tell you. For such a cross-border expedition in Africa and with my own vehicle, there are a number of things to anticipate. Obviously, each country has its own set of rules and regulations, and it's better to make sure I've got the right items with me. One of them, and for many countries in here, a honeycomb reflective tape is required. White tape on the front bumper and red on the rear one. Luckily, I could easily find these specific tapes in a shop when I was in Cape Town. And before the first border crossing in Africa, it was time to decorate Rafiki. Of course, you need to provide a few more other documents to enter a country. The carnet de passage en douane is required in most countries around Africa and makes it easier and cheaper with the authorities. Passport, driving license, better to carry the international one as well, which is required for Botswana, for example. Vehicles registration paper, yellow fever certificate, local currency in cash, and some special documents you need to make at certain borders. I've got 18 days to show Botswana to Valerie. Starting from Tsabong, we are going to drive through Kang and Hansi to finally eat Maun in a week time. Guys, welcome to Botswana. So I was sleeping when suddenly... After too much tar road, we decided to drive a little sandy track in the bush. Quickly after we stopped here, we met the smile of Cabo and his hairy best friends. Cabo comes from the Tswana ethnicity, a Bantu-speaking group who are native to southern Africa, and the biggest one in Botswana, around 80% of the population. Eh? You can come in.
chef de la cuisine. Il est vraiment bien foutu ici ce camping. Elle est à table parce que ça va être froid. Hop. Petit branchement euh, du frigo. Puis il ne faut pas que je vexe la chef qui a préparé euh, un merveilleux un dîner. Super repas. Alors attends, je suis dans la lumière. Au top. Houmous avocat. Un tartine de houmous avocat. Et là, on a quoi Du couscous. Du couscous avec des haricots. <rire> Ah là là, couscous, ouais, mais ça devient franc. Haricot. Comment ça, mmh. moi Un délice. <rire> the cold of winter has definitely arrived in the Kalari Desert. The nights are very fresh and temperature drop below zero degrees sometimes. But nature lullabies make us easily forget about our cold feet. Look at my outfit. So cold. La cuisine Le salon, petit canapé La voiture Le bureau Le garage La chambre d'amis La chambre principale le coin buanderie <laughs> et le coin à la piste de danse. I want to stay active as much as I can during the solo expedition. And with such beautiful surroundings, I had to go for a wide run in the bush. And then... Une branche verte, ça se trouve tu vas finir seul dans ton voyage. Hein. Ouais mais c'est pas grave, j'ai Rafiki. Okay, <laughs> Attends, je vais essayer de descendre. Non, non, c'est pas solide ça. Hein. Ah, c'est pas solide Non, non, c'est pas solide, c'est un poteau électrique. Allez Jacqueline. Tu veux pas Sinon, j'allais dire de ramener mes caisses. Non, non, c'est mort. Et mon petit singe euh, Ok, attends, 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 bouge pas. T'es sérieuse, là C'est-à-dire <rire> Bah oui, je suis sérieuse. Euh, tu montes, là, ou tu descends Je descends. La coopération quand j'ai demandé de m'amener les caisses, on va. Les gens sont transat, qui lit pendant 6 heures. Putain, tu vois, je m'endormirai me, pas avec la méditation, mais avec le résumé du livre. To fit a snorkel on Rafiki was one of my top priorities regarding the off-road equipment for Africa. And even if installing a snorkel involves making holes in the vehicle body, I had to get this pipe fixed next to the bonnet. The benefits of a snorkel include fuel efficiency, increased performance, and reduced wear and tear. The elevated position of the snorkel allows your vehicle to take in cleaner and cooler air that's contaminant-free. And that day, I decided to get rid of the standard head to upgrade Rafiki with a Cyclonid Pre-Cleaner one. Why? Because it simply offers an additional form of protection for the raised air intake of the snorkel. A secondary filtration definitely helps to filter out dust, debris, bugs and rain. C'est mieux Il faut serrer encore un peu ou pas Il monte vers le haut quand tu fais ça, non The sky is burning. Wow. New snorkel. So ready to hit the road. And while approaching the next stopover of the trip, we had absolutely no idea that a few minutes later we were about to get attacked by a. No, no, not a lion. <laughs> I'll let you discover.
Ski pants. It's good. Cool.